Oh, 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 I'm not even ready. Stop. Stop. I'm not dressed up yet. I've only just begun. I'm a navy blue and red dragon. And there's my friend. He has a scale. Dragons have scales. And the scales protect him. And in this life, the scale is supposed to tell us everything. So it tells us our weight. It tells us our weight in gold. It just tells us to wait at the doctor so we go into the scale because we have nothing else to do. The scale of the dragon is what protects him. It's his neck, okay, from here to here. What did Alice, was it Alice in Wonderland or Dorothy? It's Dorothy. She slayed the dragon. They said she was the queen, but I thought it was going to be a messiah. Is it not a messiah? A messiah was a girl. It was her. Well, that was the representation. Another thing I was thinking about, really crazy. It's really crazy because I forgot. You know what I'm wearing here? Look. It all went away. Okay, I put pink near it. The minute you put pink near it, it hardly stays. Well, we're pink, aren't we? But you can barely see it through our skin. Because every separation, every lens, every difference makes a difference. I just thought I'd wear this for number 29, Ken Dryden, because I'm his number now. It's the only number you can ever get. That's the first, I'm sorry, that's the first number, the first time you can ever get that number, two. Two and nine is two. And then after that, what do you have next? What? What? You know what I'm doing to say because I forgot. <laughs> so I'm tricking you. It gives me time to move on. So um, 29, 38 is 11. And 38 is the Alpha Omega of the roulette game. 38. 3 times 8 is 24. And we all know 2, 4, and 4, 8 make, make who we are 5, the passage to live. We have to be the average to live here. We have to be a five because we're a six, but we were three in creation by one and two. So how much are we now? But our birth was nine, but that's okay. We're in the eight heaven of the seven islands, but there's only six islands we can use, but they would say that's a long island because it was a long island iced tea and that represents long islands. I don't know what happens out there, but I know my family, part of them lived out there and just the feeling, the, the wave I get off of them, they're all like, let's go to work, and nothing, nothing, it's like down to earth, more down to earth. Is it possible that the closer we get to an ocean, the better we feel? And all the old people moved down to Florida in the Keys. Now they're trapped by two oceans, plus the ocean of the sky is three. Well, the ground is like an ocean. It's an ocean of sand. It's in a big, 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 big ball. And we're all having fun. Are we having fun yet? What is your question? A guy comes up to do something, right? And my stomach hurts, I need something. A guy comes up to do something, okay? And you talk to him and he does what he does and he gets the job done. And all of a sudden you go to the guy, he goes, aren't you that guy, Mr. Fix-It-All? You can do everything? And the guy goes, I'm just me. I only fix all what you tell me to if I could. And when it's done, I fix all that you said. So now you say to your friend, He's a Mr. Know-it-all. And you go to his friend, and he knew it all. So this man is still a Mr. Know-it-all. Now he gets to the last man, third area, gives him a job. He says, can you do the job? And I said, I can only try. If you'd like to know whether or not the possibilities that I can do it are high, I would say, yes, they are good. But whatever chance that it can't happen, it will be on the negative side. So that negative of only 22% actually came into fact. Only 22% means life. So come into his house to do it. And I did her real good. Nine months later, he says, you didn't do it good enough. He says, my wife is still not pregnant. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't. You know, I can bring you into any story you want. It's all the way we perceive it. And what if this guy couldn't do it at the end? What if he couldn't? What if this guy was God? And at the end, he couldn't find the Messiah because nobody understood. They understood to pray. They understood well. But it's the average five that doesn't count anymore. Everybody has to be a four and an extension of one meaning everybody understands what it is to be good and whether you're good or not, as long as you try and you understand, sometimes decisions in life are not that easy to make and we make mistakes. 
and it's okay because you've only been here once in your memory but this world existed before with the same amount of people on it I don't know if it existed where we are I don't know exactly how that works but uh, wasn't the rule in law one at a time one day's enough is that three's enough one day at a time so now he fails and he goes to his first friend he says your buddy ain't no good he goes to his second friend they discuss it he say ain't no good the other one says he's good they come up to him and they say hey bud didn't you say you can do everything I said well listen to me I said I can do anything that you ask it doesn't mean I'm going to succeed just like if they ask a guy to come here and everybody says, look, look, it's a bird, it's a plane, it's the Messiah, the Messiah, he comes. But he only comes in your face. That's all, he only comes in your face because now you're dying, you're hot, you're horny because you see a Messiah. But that's your eyes, the guy comes down, he only wants to do is go to McDonald's, you know? And everybody starts saying, oh, Messiah, Messiah. And then this guy makes a big, big, big mistake not a bad mistake but in the eyes of man a big mistake and they all start throwing rocks at him and stones at him but nobody called him the Messiah Jesus was not the Messiah the Messiah means to clean up Jesus was here to help us grow he's the Holy Father he's not the Messiah he didn't come here to save the world there was no world to save there's a whole big earth here do you think God created this earth just for one side of the world? Wouldn't it be tilt? When you tilt, game's over. The machine ball don't work no more when you play the arcades. He had to balance beam it. Take a look at all the numbers you use. Take a look at on Microsoft on my windows here. I press the time and the calendar comes out and it shows me 30 days for November and it shows me two days for uh, October and it shows me 10 days for December it's connecting October November December O N D O N D it's the sound of music it's the owns it's what we hear it's the music O N D you have to look through things say it slow say it fast do it like the birds do it some birds chirp quick some birds chirp slow sometimes the bird next to him chirps at the same time because they're trying to give a message inside of it like a W so two birds chirp and you got a W you know what I'm saying? Three birds trip, you got a uh, chirp, chirp, you got a triple. And you got a triple shot of that stuff. And now my friend likes to play Scrabble. And you got a triple word pay, two points, one point, three points, four points. How did they choose their points? Well, it's very simple. Give me the game board and I'll tell you. I don't have one in front of me. I told you. And I always tell you this. I tell you because you ask. And I tell you because you ask and I must tell you. I only tell you what you ask. So I'm not telling you anything more than what you ask? I don't know. I only say. Hypothesis. Is, was that Einstein? Remind me of that last segment because I got mixed up. Reminding myself what I remember. What we want to remember. It's not that we want to remember. We classify things inside our mind. And uh, when you want to go to the racetrack and it's your son's birthday, uh, well, it's only uh, 11 o'clock and... Uh, at night and his birthday's tomorrow so I can go down to the, to the, to the casino until like uh, maybe one o'clock and come home at two I'll be there for eleven and at two o'clock I got a big hand huge hand I got all diamonds against this guy who just bluffed two other guys in the last six hands and shows his cards and laughs I got five hundred in front of me I throw in forty bucks okay I'm trying to weasel out an extra forty bucks I should have thrown seventy dollars if he was if he throws in the forty you know and then he's gonna raise and you give him a chance to rave I let him in I let him in the door so when we're thinking right we're letting other thoughts in the door you gotta play the game a little bit like bluff our life is based on all the gambling card games bridge um, monopoly pool what, all balls and colors and horses and stuff it's so great but it's never enough Snuffleupagus, stuff it, snuff, snuff, stuff. You just keep repeating it. It just is the word. Sesame Street is full of, um, I mean, that's how I know because I watched it when I was younger. Um, what did I come on here to do? Oh, yeah, you know what's really funny? Oh, I don't know if it's still playing. Can you hear that water in the back? 
anyways, in November, okay, I wish I could do the count for it. Why am I stopping like this? Because I'm in big pain. It hurts so bad for 25 years already. I don't understand what I'm doing. But I thought one day I'd said, what if the acid inside of me is supposed to kill all that bad stuff in my mind? Maybe the acid is what helps spin the ball inside the mind. The second U of the W, it just keeps that ball rolling and moving and moving. You constantly make, you're constantly thinking now because of one action, one reaction. And talking about action and reaction, the dragon gets killed here. Man gets killed here. Man's big mouth creates. Man's little mouth down there with the one eye creates. This mind is not doing too good. The one down there gets sick because of what we do and say. And it doesn't matter if it's you. Sometimes they need you upstairs because sometimes they have to take the good ones away before they room. Before they get room, they had enough here. They don't need to be here anymore. But in all actuality, they take away the good ones because they need good angels to even out the bad angels with the new lives coming into this world. So they have to put them in a new body and either be the body, okay, or the angel. Don't forget, you and your angel, you're all a team. It's just like the California angels. Cal, Calais, Kalesh, a horse ride, Christmas, Kali Kala, Kala Kala. What does Kala Kala mean? It means this. Knock, knock, knock. Who's there? Kala. Kala who? I call in to collect. It's a collection agency just calling you all the time. Kala Kala. Call me, call me. I'll call you, I'll call you. Call me back, call, call, call. Leave a message. Don't leave a message. I robot says, I am. It is urgent that you call back. Why, what's happening? If it's urgent, I would know already. It's in my body. That means my life. The most urgent thing you will ever have is your own life. It's urgent. So if someone calls you and tells you it's urgent, you better think twice. It means they're not thinking about you at all. Because like I said, it's your life, then your son's life. I think it goes back to your father and mother and then to your ex-wife. Well, the ex-wife is because she made a mark inside of who you are today. Regardless of what happened, you had to think whether your decision was good or bad. It, it would create the time inside of you in which that bad will turn good because you'll be able to use it in a situation. Even if it's the wrong situation, you can use it as the right way. So you know what I'm saying? What was bad and wrong there? I know it's a little confusing. It's all confusing for me and I'm still in pain with this ulcer attack. It's terrible. Pink. Is it all about pink? Pink, Colonel Clink, Hogan's Heroes, Clink, lock them up in pink. We're all in pink. I know nothing. Mm. Right? And who did we have? Uh, Pierre, the cook. And uh, how come I can't remember his name? I really liked all those shows. Or how about Mash, or The Ash, or The Stashing of the Cash Underneath the Ground? Cashing of the Stash. Wasn't Ben Laden underneath the ground? Wasn't he a cash fall? If he gets loose, oh my God, that's detrimental. So the cash man had to go. And it was represented by the B, which means life, because that's what his name means. The Boston Bruins mean both sides of life, and Ben Laden means the ladle of life, okay? Maybe he did bad, I don't know, but the name doesn't say bad. If you have a Ben, you're in the den. It means you're relaxing, you're taking it easy. You don't need this crap. But guess what? When you're when you're small or when you're big, when you have an army to protect you because you're scared, well, he had no choice. No choice. What stories are out there? Muhammad, ma, mother, heaven, angel, of both, uh, the heaven of God. Man. Vietnam. Who went to Vietnam? You go to Vietnam? I went to Vietnam. What? V? Et parlez-vous français? We, uh, Vietnam, tu connais tu? Tu, does no, does tu know tu? I say to the man, tu connais tu? Which means, do you know this? And in all actuality, I'm saying, tu connais tu? Conna, anaconda. Anna, year. Con.
consummate the word. The Conway rail system, the system we are on right now, Conways of the short lines. We're into the 18th chapter of this 7,280 page book in which most likely 10, 10, 10 world brings you up to a time in which you couldn't even read the whole thing because I don't know the whole thing. So what were we at? We were at the train, we were at the Con, Con Smythe Trophy, we were at the uh, Boston Bruins, and we were at uh, um, Ben Laden. And um, Boston Bru Bruins mean life, under the ground. I can't explain it. You're gonna have to remind me of this also. Uh, I wanted to ex explain to you what it meant under the ground and, and why I chose Boston to come back to life. Ben, Bears Den downstairs watching TV. Oh, what was he watching downstairs on the TV? He was watching all the planes over and above looking to kill him. But he knew long before, just like Jesus Christ knew, okay, that he was going to get killed. Because he's not stupid. He's seen other people get killed for less. You know, don't forget, magic was always a thing of, the, of something that you shouldn't be doing up to a certain point. And at Jesus' time, there it's not magic. You cannot do that magic. Why? Because everybody else has decided. Now when you make a choice and it's an okay choice, now you're in trouble. This is the world we are in. Everybody else gets us in trouble. He comes here, he's not the Messiah, but it didn't matter because there was money at stake. And the stake that they had wasn't stake at all, it was money. They were at the synagogue or whatever, selling all that stuff, and Jesus walked in. He didn't give a fuck no more. Because he knew he had was protected on two sides. By his people and by his father. So he was protected. So once you see someone's around that's going to be and ought to be, don't think that he is. Just think that he needs the protection because if he gets the protection, he gets to go a little bit longer in life and maybe to prove to everybody of who he is. In all actuality, all he's doing is a normal thing. But everybody's wishing and hoping that he'd do something that's not normal to everybody else. But they already see that he's not doing anything normal is the way people look at me because I am a pirate. So um, what's happening right now is clock hasn't changed. It's been like this since yesterday. Have you ever seen what the Pac-Man actually is and how it's designed? Oh yeah, not only that. Let me take this out. But uh, Facebook doesn't even know it, but they're involved. They're involved in giving out the secrets of the coming man. Because when I listen to the music, you want to hear this? This music, my friends, I do not know from where in which it comes, but I do know from where I got it online. This is Facebook, okay? I think it is the farmland or something. Now my mouse doesn't want to work. So I, I grab my mouse by the tail. I can't even lift it, see it's got a tail. I can't stand the mouse with a tail. But because I know what's happening to me right now and everything I do seems to, um, uh, doesn't we, uh, that's what's happening to it right now. I can't think, but my computer opens up, shuts down, it goes away, comes away. I'll do a 20 minute video, it'll go away, and then I'm saying, oh my God, maybe I shouldn't have gone that far. Maybe I had to back up. So somebody help me back up. Um, when I go ahead, some of the stories you see, if you read what I write, um, all come by the tags. Because when my tag comes up, I see five different things and I look, and then I pick one of them. And then I pick another one and I say, okay, let me put the word that's missing. And then I'll pick another one. It'll always give me like two, three, four, five words. So I put ones that's missing. I say, well, what word should go before this? What word should go after this? And I make up a whole story with it. And then I can write almost for an hour the whole thing. I can just keep writing and writing because they just keep giving me five words. And I guess that's all it took in life, right? The first commandment of the Lord God, zero. And one, two, three, four, five. Right? Uh, one, two, three, four. Zero, one, two, three, four. That's how it all began. Because zero is God. He's the egg. And everything else goes inside of him. When he takes it out, it's on the outside. Or he puts it on the inside. Have you ever played tic-tac-toe? Well, let me show you something. You see this? See this corner here? They're all corners. You know, that makes...
I feel like I'm writing on one of those, what's it called? Tic-tac-toe. The center is created by the four automatically. This doesn't exist. The only reason it's there is because of this and this. If you put these all together. The 11, you see the 11? The 11 creates the connection. Otherwise it looks like this one here. This is the cross because the cross chops off four corners. And these corners are the creation corners. Down here where the tail is, oh yeah, and this would be the pitchfork. This is the fourth part, the bottom of the phone. It's the star key, the zero, and the pound key. Because the star key says the eight heaven. And the zero says two and eight. And when you turn, if you turn the Rubik's cube, or you turn to what's it called? The bottom of the phone, it don't, this only moves on the phone. The four pieces on the bottom, if you had to do it, they'd have to turn. Because they're an expression. They're actually more like in the wiring than anything else but they're there anyways. It's on the Sanskrit of the Mayan. It has a loop like this, like a mustache, and there's nothing in between it. And that's where the balls balance. There are two jacks are there. One jack is your father, and I think one jack is you. Is there a movie about that, Jack? What's up, man? I'm in black jack land, but I'm a white man, so I painted myself up so I can figure out in between what I'll do because I'm a little yellow. I'm a yelling at nobody, but the blue and the red and making me yellow makes the black of who I actually am and that gives you a lot of soul and I always wanted to dance in my life but I couldn't do it but I fear you know what if I can't do it on the floor I can show off to thousands and thousands of people because when everybody dances nobody actually really looks they do but you got to be good well they're just looking at your face for a second so what happened I dance with words I'm dancing with the words I am dancing with the words I am dancing with the wolves Dancing with the wolves. We are dancing with the wolves of the words that we see because it's the words that became our friend and enemy. They're all a bunch of fags. Do I answer that? I'll look. I'll take a look. I'm curious. Yeah. I'm busy making a video. I'm in the middle of the video. You're now on the video. Yeah. Why is everything okay? Yeah, I didn't go in. I went to sleep at five. I'm really, really busy, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try my best for next week. But this is, this is going very good. I, I this is going very good since yesterday. Very, very good. Very. It's, it's. This is, this is the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life because I found a way to write. Do you know where? After I make a, after I make a video, right? There's a place at the there's a place at the bottom that says tag. So I said tag. Oh my god, I said tag. When we were kids, we played tag. It means connect the, the the words. But it doesn't it doesn't tell you that you ran all the way over there, which means it doesn't tell you if and or but in between all the words. So I add in the if ands and buts and I can tell a story based on what the computer is actually doing. I'm almost like talking to the computer. So, and I only had one person tell me that it was very good, and they sent me something for free, but I, you know, when it comes free, you know, I gotta spend my time to check it out, and I gotta check out everything that's free. When something's free, you check it out twice as much as when you go to something. So, anyways, let me finish this. I'm gonna call you back, all right? Okay, and the car started this morning. Thanks. My brother, my brother, bye. Yeah, you know what, I wasn't honest for many years. I couldn't tell anybody, I'm sorry. I couldn't leave my work. Whistle while you work. I o I o. Off to work we go. I o I o. I o. I always goddamn o. I never know where I should go. I o I o I o. So do I go to the bank? It's a rupture. The bank is a rupture in your wallet. So where do I go? E I E I O. I don't really know. Come to my little heaven and I will put on the show. Because in my heaven, everything is dirt cheap. Because dirty deeds were done dirt cheap here on this planet. And now it's time to advance into the next world. But not before we have a shift. A shift in the action. The period has ended and we're into the final period. Or is it the final inning? 
What are we in right now? If it would be the final inning, to start again, we'd have to be in the ninth inning. Or overtime and in the fourth period. But if hockey ends in a tie, it's okay. Because the puck is still on ice, and that puck is oil. And it's the oil that got us into all this trouble. When you associate with a mongar, a hungar, when you're hungry for the money, a monger, hungry for money, hungry for money, because you know what happens? First, we only need what we need. And then we need a little bit more just in case. And now there's more people. Now we got to start storing some wheat in the corn bins. We stored 1,500 corns, 1,500 tons of corn in one bin. And in the other bin, I, were they 1,500 tons, Dad? Now, I know you don't watch anyways, but it, was, it wasn't 500 tons because I got 300 tons in the small one. I used to dump the feed for the animals all the time. Oh my God, did we break our ass. But you know what? When you're on a farm, uh, just ask Michael Jackson because you're in another heaven. You have to go because the pigs are going. And you see the pigs going, so you're happy because at least you're doing your job and you see the action happening and you don't have to do anything at all except hold the bo a board. But board, we was in the boardroom. And we held the boardroom, but it was only for the big birds and not for the small birds. They left the small birds out to dry. And now they're in the sky duping on us the acid rain, reminding us. Well, it rains cats and dogs, no? And birds are on the wire? So wouldn't you think they're on the wire? Their feet are on fire? They're birds for hire? Come on, bird, birds for hire, birds for hire, birds for hire. What are you talking about, birds? Hey, man, you know what birds mean in my country? It means a woman, it means a hooker, man. What are you talking about, the bird? The bird is a good thing, you know. Without the bird, Okay, man's story, or should I say his story that's gotten stuck up, and the only thing that sticks up in man's bird is because he tells the story and he don't care what happens in between as long as his little story is going up some kind of bush or into the forest of the unknown where the wolf is when they shouldn't have entered into Little Red Riding Hood. That's very funny because it sounds like piggy bank because if Little Red Riding Hood is having her period and he's a wolf and he doesn't care about her, so he rapes her. He wasn't going after grandma, he raped her. It was just a story. Her grandma, his story, his history, hysterectomy of the wolf. What is that all about? What does that mean? I only say it because it comes to me, so I say it. It's free, whatever I say. It's free! Oh my God, you better check it out twice. Isn't it crazy, everything that's free and easy? <laughs> Uh, the percentage of get you getting into trouble with all the free and easies is a lot bigger than more difficult because more difficult at least you can give up because you saw it was a chance you would not succeed and you knew what the limitations were so you stopped you didn't give up you stopped you it was a judgment call because you gave up it doesn't mean you gave up at all you stopped you made a judgment call now based on are you lazy okay are you a good for nothing what do you deserve who are you do you know who you are Go in front of the mirror, look into your eyes, but watch out for a surprise because most people, they could, but they can't. They should, but they shouldn't. Because the minute you see right into your eyes, from that point on for the rest of your life, you're going to remember. Because we remember everything the first time around. Everything else for some reason, once you get the 5th Street and 6th Street, well, when you're in 5th Street and 6th Street, what happens there, guys, when you play poker in 5th Street? What does that mean? You're sitting in 5th position, 5th one to call, the street, Sesame Street, Shazam, and into the world we come. Sesame Street, the area of uh, 41, is actually the passage into this world. Shazam, and here we come. Here we come to Kingdom Kong. Was it King? King Kong? King Kong and God? Zillion. God's a zillion because those are all his children. Three zeros, right? Three zeros and three zeros. What does he have, a daughter and two sons? Is that what God has? A daughter and two sons and one spirit. Well, he's got the spade, he's got the heart, and he's got the club. The club is a female. And if you look at the club card, everybody's wearing a club hat. They're all at the clubhouse, and that's where we are right now. We're at the clubhouse and we went onto the field to play in baseball. And you know what's funny about baseball is the Expos baseball dugouts and the old dugouts were like not really actually dugout. 
because the dugouts from now, I mean, you look over the top, you look like a fox looking on into the game. No one can see my eyes. Let's put the dugout three feet down. No one can see my players and what we're actually doing, so let's go and hide. It's almost like war, but it's a baseball war. For bases and balls. Bases. Come on. Beta world, beta world aces? Aces and bases? Aces and bases. What's a base? A base of his balls. Ah, ace eight. Bases. Ace eight. B, beta world ace. Okay. Ace, base, ace, space. It's eight because the opposite of two is eight on the telephone. Wow, that's so cool, man. Oh, I wish I could do this forever and ever and ever. Oh my god. Wow. It's going to end one day. Maybe because I'll know it all, but I'll know nothing at all. So I can't say it that way, because if it stops, it might be because there's no more place. My head is now empty. Oh no, my head is full. So I got a lot of gas to go, yet I can't remember anything at all. So this time my head gets full, so I can't put any more in. So the gas tank is full, and you can drive all the way till it's empty. But when you can't put any more information in your mind, that means you have to stop, because you won't be able to remember or think anymore. Okay, so is, that, is it good for our, our, our brain to be full? No. Like they said, the water's half empty, the water's half full. The ride of the ocean, the rock and the sway brings us always the next and better day for all of us to be here, to be aware and to stay in the world we love for a better day. It's funny, eh? So I can do this and every night I go to sleep and even while I'm doing it, I say to myself, you know what? Time to change the clock. Ta-da! What movie are we in? <coughs> We should do all the movies. And I'll sit here and play one part, but I'll play the part for all the movies. Whatever came down. And we all can do it. You see, if you all send me back something from a movie, right? Obviously, if there's a million people, I'm not gonna be able to do everything. But if I had a computer and just said, okay, these are the 10 things for this week, this week, for this week, here's 10. 10 commandments. Let's talk about 10 things of what you think you want to know or what we should discuss about all the movies. And then we can write a book that brings all the movies of Hollywood together because